For centuries, people married for money, not for love. And today, maybe there's a little love there, but there's also some money. And here's why you need a prenuptial agreement before you waltz down the aisle. Who needs a prenup? Well, more younger people are getting them. That's because they have substantial assets even before they get married. They've got stock options, a la Mark Zuckerberg, or they have degrees advanced degrees like a law school degree, well that has earning potential and that's why you need the prenup. The basic prenup is pretty simple. It's what's mine is mine, what's yours is yours. However, there are some funky things that can happen. For example, somebody has a great wine collection. They don't want their spouse to get it in the event of divorce. That can be written into a prenup. Now, there's even been prenups where weight gain is a variable. So if you gain too much weight, you're not getting so much money at the time of divorce. And just so you know, I asked some divorce attorneys and sex is not a stipulation in a prenup. Can't prove it. How far in advance should you get a prenup? Well, the sooner the better because you do not want to be signing that prenup on the day of your wedding. Experts say six months is ideal, but the reality is, is that most couples do it within a month. 50% of all marriages do end in divorce, and that's why you need to protect your assets and get a prenup. Relative to existing demand, pending home sales are a lot lighter than people would have expected, especially given low mortgage rates. But what, what you're seeing is a lot of concern about what is going on out there in the general economy. So right now, rent versus buy. What would